Okay, are you ready? Yep, yeah, absolutely. Thanks. Uh, okay, well, the aim was to talk about science versus pseudoscience. Unfortunately, I seem to have ended up with a pile of wooden weapons sitting up there, fairly vicious looking. Although, the middle one, probably the most vicious looking one of all, is Tiger Wood. And I don't mean the golfer, I mean this guy's Tiger Wood. <laughs> um, for some reason, people seem to think it's a great idea to cut off the poor sod's welly, stick it in alcohol, drink the alcohol, supposedly to get his vitalism, his spirit, rather than a couple of boot blue pills to, um, shall we say, perk things up. In the West, we had spirits, the air, the water, the earth, the fire, as our spiritualism. In the East, it becomes the chi. When we're looking at chi and the vitalism of chi, we see things um, like acupuncture, with its needles, it's going to change the flow of chi all around. The I actually don't care, okay? Don't care about chi, that doesn't bother me. What worries me is when you get science, or people trying to pretend that it's science, a pseudoscience, using scientific terms to pass off things that aren't real science. So people that try and get to pop lots of pills, so that you build up all your nutrition, avoid all sorts of illnesses, and all it does is make expensive urine. We have homeopathy. Homeopathy is brilliant, full of really toxic substances, but it's such ridiculously high dilutions that thankfully it will never have an effect either as a toxin or therapeutically. If you want to take just one single molecule of a homeopathic remedy, you need to ingest the equivalent mass of about 15 times the earth. Okay? Um, it's the equivalent of putting about a mill of water into 33 times the volume of all the water of the earth, taking a mill back out and expecting it to have any properties. But, it's the memory of water, the memory of water that protects you against it. Of course, I know what that water had the memory of. I don't want it to remember. <laughs> there are effects though, it does work, it's called the placebo effect. We see even in science, um, the placebo drug in a drugs trial sometimes works even better. But when you're doing that, what you need to do is make sure the therapy is weird and unusual. People need to think they're doing something. So it's a big blue <coughs> pill, or it's a really unusual treatment that you have to do. It's got to go perhaps in an unusual place. <laughs> and then you get a really good effect. It's why there are still some people who will swear by mixing honey with album grecum, otherwise known as white dog shite, white fluffy dog shite, and smear it all over the throat to protect them. <laughs> Now the best thing is, charge people lots of money. If you charge lots of money, it must be working. And the cosmetic industry has been doing that for years. They know just how to play, particularly women, and I, I don't know how many of you have spent lots of money in the womb, but after all, what can be more satisfying to a woman than healthy, glowing skin? Um, I mean, obviously not a, a career, ambition, family, money, none, none of that. A healthy, glowing skin. They'll give you great terms, and you'll have heard these terms, Real refuel surface skin cells. The surface skin cells are all dead, okay? <laughs> if you want to refuel, I'd suggest you eat the sandwich rather than smear it all over your face and work a lot better. <laughs> Give skin a dewy glow. Have I heard that one? Dewy, it just means damp. Glow, <laughs> it means red. If you want to get hot and sweaty, just go for a job rather than spending a fortune on a drug. Replumps and tautens. Well, if you're dehydrated, you go all saggy, drink a glass of water, it's a bit cheaper. <laughs> you see, scientific, how many have seen these terms, but don't even know what they mean? Pentapeptides, lipopeptides, platinum colloidal water. Platinum colloidal water is why people can charge you £650 for a 50 millimetre jar, mill jar of cream, which has absolutely no scientific merit whatsoever, <laughs> and they won't publish anything. Hyaluronic acid causes an immune effect. You can get the same thing by rubbing nettles in your face, stinging nettles in your face, okay? There are things that we can do. I'm a dermatologist. We can do things like getting, and we're working on it, and getting rid of liver spots, age spots. All it is is just a colour in your skin. So we can do stuff about it. There is some real science out there. Most of it's pseudoscience. Most of it's nonsense. Here's the big secret. I can help you defy the signs of ageing, okay? I'll tell you, it's a big secret, don't let it pass beyond these walls, okay? Um, eat lots of fresh food, drink lots of water. That's the two most important things you can do. And if you do that, all the rest of the creams mean absolutely nothing. 
other than you've got an empty pocket, spend it on the alcohol instead, okay? <laughs> <laughs> and with that,